Hello everyone, welcome back to the question answer discussion session. So today's question is, which of the following benzodiazepine drug is short acting? A choice, diazepam, B choice, fluoracepam, C choice, nitrazepam, D choice, triazolam, E choice, midazolam. So before coming to the correct answer, let's understand a few facts about benzodiazepine. So benzodiazepines, abbreviated as BDZ, they have mainly three uses. One is they can be used as a sedative hypnotic drug. They can be used as a sedative hypnotic drug. They can also be used as an anti-anxiety drug. They can also be given uh, in the treatment of epilepsy, that is, that is an anti-convulsant drug. So these are some of the important uses of uh, Benzodiazepine, sedative hypnotic, they are anti-anxiety drugs, they are also can be used as an anti-convulsant drug. Now, based on the duration of action, based on the duration of action, Benzodiazepines could be divided into three categories. One is long-acting, the second one is short-acting, the third one is ultra sh short acting. So this classification that is long acting, short acting, ultra short acting is based on the duration of action. That means long acting drug benzodiazepine has a duration of action between 24 to 48 hours. Whereas short-acting benzodiazepines have a duration of action from ranging from 12 to 24 hours. Whereas ultra-short-acting has a duration of action which is less than 6 hours. It is less than 6 hours. Okay. Now, which all drugs, which all benzodiazepines belongs to each of this category? So, let's start with the long-acting benzodiazepine. So for this you can remember this mnemonic DCC, DCC, FCC. So D stands for diazepam, C stands for clonazepam, the second C stands for clobazam, F stands for fluoracepam, The C, this C stands for chlordisipoxide. The last C stands for chlor, chlorazepate. So room, you can remember this uh, mnemonic DCC FCC. Okay, so these are the important drugs which belongs to the long-acting benzodiazepine category. Now coming to the second category that is short-acting. Short-acting benzodiazepine. You can remember this mnemonic: all NIT hotel, all NIT all NIT hotel are short. All NIT hotels are short. So all stands for alprazolam. So alprazolam is a short acting uh, um, benzodiazepine. NIT, N sta uh, NIT stands for nitrazepam. Nitrazepam is a short acting benzodiazepine. In the hotel, hotel H stands for halazepam. So halazepam is a short acting benzodiazepine. O stands for oxazepam. T stands for Timazepam, TE stands for Timazepam, L stands for Lorazepam. So you can remember this mnemonic, all NIT hotels are, they are basically short acting. Ok, 
ഓക്കെ അൽപ്രാസോളം നൈട്രാസിപ്പാം ഹലാസിപ്പാം ഒക്സാസിപ്പാം തീമാസിപ്പാം ആൻഡ് ലോറാസിപ്പാം ന കമ്മിങ് ടു ദ ലാസ്റ്റ് കാറ്റഗറി ദാറ്റ് ഈസ് ദ അൾട്രാ ഷോർട്ട് ആക്ടിംഗ് അൾട്രാ ഷോർട്ട് ആക്ടിംഗ് ബെൻസോ ഡൈസിപ്പൈൻ യു ക്യാൻ റിമമ്പർ ദിസ് സിനിമോണിക് യു ടി എം വെർ ടി സ്റ്റാൻഡ്സ് ഫോർ ട്രയാസോളം ആൻഡ് എം സ്റ്റാൻഡ്സ് ഫോർ മിഡാസോളം സോ ട്രയാസോളം and midasolum have a duration of action less than 6 hours therefore they belongs to ultra short acting benzodiazepine category now coming to the question which of the following drug is uh, short acting so uh, diazepam we have studied the mnemonic dcc fcc so, so diazepam is a long acting benzodiazepine fluoracepam dcc fcc we have studied it in the long acting uh, benzodiazepine so fluoracepam is also long acting nitrazepam we have studied the mnemonic all night hotels are short so nit means all nit hotels are short so n n nitrazepam they are basically short acting triazolam midazolam i asked you to remember utm so they are basically uh, uh, ultra short acting ultra short acting so the correct answer for this question the short acting drug the answer is c choice nitrazepam thank you